Have you ever closed your eyes and pictured yourself a winner? Not just in the game of life, but a lottery winner? Millions of dollars at your fingertips. Unlimited possibilities stretching out before you. It's a fantasy as old as time itself. And I'm sure you're like most people buying a ticket, hoping against hope that this is finally your time to hit it big. But what if winning the lottery wasn't just a matter of dumb luck? What if there were ways to tap into something more powerful ways to align your very thoughts and beliefs toward manifesting that winning ticket and all the abundance that comes with it? Hi, I'm Joe Dispenza. And today I want to delve into a fascinating concept that might just change the way you play the game of life, the art and science of manifestation. Yes, I said science. You see, cutting-edge research hints that our minds may hold more sway over reality than we ever realized. In this video, I'll unlock the power of focused thought, of visualization. I'll show you how these techniques can potentially be used to influence the odds in your favor. Plus, I'll touch on some incredible, almost unbelievable stories of individuals who credit manifestation with their lottery success. Could these be extreme coincidences, or is there more to it than meets the eye? So if you're ready to take your dreams off the shelf and start actively shaping your reality, stick around. By the end of this video, you may hold a powerful new tool not just for winning lotteries, but for transforming every aspect of your life. And one more thing, if you find value in what I'm sharing, don't forget to like, subscribe to our channel World is Life and hit that notification bell. Let's explore the power of manifestation together. Before we talk about the science and the potential of manifestation, let's dive into the raw emotion that surrounds the lottery experience. There's a peculiar energy in that simple slip of paper. Maybe you're standing in line at the corner store or carefully selecting your lucky numbers online. There's a buzz, isn't there? A thrilling blend of anticipation and possibility. For a moment, as you wait for those numbers to flash on the screen, or be announced on the news, everyday anxieties seem to fade away. That ticket becomes a tangible representation of an extraordinary future at your fingertips. Visions of a worry-free existence dance through your head, a dream home perhaps, the chance to travel the world, or simply knowing your loved ones are taken care of, financially secure for generations to come. We all know that rationally the odds of hitting the jackpot are astronomical, and yet that sliver of hope refuses to be extinguished. It's part of the human spirit, this relentless desire for something greater. The lottery, in its own way, taps into that yearning and transforms it into a shared experience. Suddenly, it's not just about you anymore. You start to think about how your winnings could make a difference in the world. Maybe you donate to your favorite cause, start a foundation, or uplift your community with meaningful projects. The possibilities feel endless as you allow your imagination to run wild. Whether your chosen numbers are based on birthdays, lucky charms, or just a random whim, buying that ticket gives your dreams permission to breathe. It's a small act of rebellion against the ordinary, a testament to our unyielding belief that life can change in the blink of an eye. Now, some might argue that lottery fever is mere escapism a temporary distraction from the hardships of reality. But I believe it hints at something deeper. It reveals our innate drive to strive for better, to envision a more fulfilling version of ourselves. Every time you check those numbers, you're casting a vote for abundance. You're broadcasting a powerful desire for your circumstances to transform. And here's where things get exciting. What if we could consciously harness that energy, that intense hope and focus? What if winning the lottery wasn't just random chance, but the culmination of a focused, intentional mindset? Let's shift our focus from the heart-pounding suspense of the lottery to a powerful concept that underpins manifestation, the law of attraction. At its core, this principle states that the nature of our thoughts deeply influences what we attract into our lives. It's the idea that like attracts like. Let's break this down a bit. Think of your mind as a powerful magnet. Whatever you consistently dwell on your fears, your hopes, your goals, that's the kind of energy you transmit to the universe around you. And according to the law of attraction, the universe responds in kind amplifying and reflecting back whatever energy you're projecting. It's a bit like tuning into a specific radio station. 
If you're constantly broadcasting on the frequency of worry, lack, and disappointment, you're more likely to keep attracting experiences that reinforce those negative states of being. But shift your thoughts toward positivity, gratitude, and abundance, and you begin tuning into a whole different reality, one filled with opportunities and fulfilling experiences. Now, this isn't about wishful thinking or pretending the challenges of life don't exist. It's about understanding the power of your focus. Every thought, every belief you entertain plays a role in shaping your experience. The law of attraction reminds us that we're not passive victims of circumstance, but active co-creators of our own destiny. This can be an incredibly empowering concept, don't you think? Picture going through life with a deep sense that your choices and your mindset have a profound impact on the world around you. Imagine facing challenges, yes, but instead of shrinking back into defeatism, you approach them with an attitude of possibility. Let's be clear, though the law of attraction isn't a magic wand. It doesn't mean instant riches or the elimination of all pain. It requires consistent practice, a dedicated shift in perspective. It's about becoming mindful of your inner dialogue and making conscious choices to cultivate thoughts that align with the life you dream of living. So how does this apply to our Grand Lottery adventure? It means going beyond merely wishing to win and truly expecting that you could. It's about embodying a mindset of abundance shedding the limiting belief that wealth is reserved for others. It's about holding a space of joyful anticipation and actively visualizing yourself as that lottery winner. Now, I understand that the law of attraction can evoke skepticism. It might seem too good to be true, a sort of new age wishful thinking. But I urge you to keep an open mind. Remember, there's growing scientific interest in the relationship between consciousness and our physical reality. Fields like quantum physics are revealing a world far stranger and more interconnected than we once assumed. And who's to say that the dedicated, powerful focus required by manifestation cannot influence the subtle forces that govern probability, even if we don't fully grasp the how it doesn't mean there's no validity to the what? So if the law of attraction is the foundational principle, manifestation is the act of making it tangible. Think of it as the bridge between your desires and their fulfillment. It's the process of transforming your dreams from mere ideas into a reality you can experience. But how exactly does manifestation work? While there's still a lot we don't know, we can break down some key elements that seem to be fundamental to this process. This is the real cornerstone of manifestation. It's about having a deep, unshakable conviction that what you want is not only possible, but in a way already exists for you. It means transcending doubts and replacing limiting beliefs with the empowering expectation that you are deserving and capable of achieving your goals. This deep belief acts like a force, creating a blueprint for your subconscious mind to work with. The mind thinks in images. Visualization is the practice of creating vivid sensory experiences in your imagination. When you visualize yourself as a lottery winner, you're not just daydreaming. You're tapping into the power of your subconscious, imprinting a powerful image of what you want, and sending the message that this isn't just a fleeting wish, but a tangible reality taking form. Try to involve all your senses. What do you see, hear, feel, even smell as that lottery winner? The more detailed, the more potent the visualization. This is about alignment, about consciously directing your energy toward a specific outcome. A clear intention acts like a compass, guiding your actions and keeping you focused on your desired manifestation. When you are clear on what you truly desire, it infuses your decisions, your energy, and the vibrations you broadcast into the world. This focused intention makes you receptive and better attuned to opportunities that might otherwise pass you by. These elements belief, visualization, and intention work in tandem. They create a potent, synergistic force, weaving themselves into the fabric of your thoughts, emotions, and actions. Many practitioners of manifestation also emphasize concepts like gratitude and the feeling of already having what you desire. It's important to understand that manifestation is seldom a passive act. While we might visualize and hold deep belief, the universe often calls upon us to take inspired action as well. This might involve seizing unexpected opportunities, 
stepping outside our comfort zones, or simply making small daily choices that move us closer to where we want to be. The truth is, no one fully grasps the inner workings of manifestation or why it seems to work so profoundly for some individuals. Yet, countless stories exist of people who attribute incredible transformations, extraordinary coincidences, and unexpected windfalls to the power of focused thought and intention. Could these be attributed to mere luck, or might there be forces at play that we simply don't fully understand? Now let's boil down the concepts we've discussed into a practical methodology for manifesting your lottery win. Remember, there's no single right way to do this. The key is to find techniques that resonate with you and that you can consistently practice with authentic belief. With that said, here's a simple framework you can adapt and personalize. Get crystal clear on what you want. Don't be vague to win some money on the lottery lacks the potent energy of a specific intention. Visualize yourself holding that winning ticket. What's the exact amount you are manifesting? What does it feel like? Don't limit yourself here if you can authentically believe it. You greatly magnify your potential to manifest it. This is perhaps the most challenging yet crucial step. It's about cultivating an unshakable inner knowing that you can and will win this lottery. This isn't blind optimism, but a deep-rooted self-trust. Examine negative beliefs you might be holding about money or luck. Actively replace those with empowering affirmations. For example, instead of thinking, I'm never lucky, reframe it as, I am open to abundance and unexpected good fortune. Spend time each day envisioning yourself as the winner. See the numbers on the screen. Hear the announcement of your victory. Most importantly, feel the emotions as if you're already living this reality, the exhilaration, the gratitude, the joyful disbelief, make it multisensory. And really allow yourself to inhabit the experience with your whole being. Tap into the emotions of already being a lottery winner. Go about your day with that sense of fulfilled abundance. What decisions would a lottery winner make? How would they carry themselves? Embodying that energy aligns your actions and vibrations with what you desire to attract. This is where those gut feelings and coincidences become important. Pay attention to any sudden urges to buy a ticket from a particular store or try a different number combination. Trust your intuition, because manifestation often guides you through subtle promptings. And of course, remember to actually purchase your lottery ticket. You can't win if you don't play. Manifestation takes dedication and patience. Make the above practices a part of your daily routine. It's also important to strike a balance between focused intention and a sense of joyful detachment. Fixating obsessively on the lottery can create a counterproductive sense of desperation. Instead, hold your desire firmly, but trust the universe's timing and allow yourself to be surprised by how events unfold. Step one, clarify your intentions. You wouldn't set out on a road trip without a clear destination, would you? The same principle applies to the journey of manifestation. Before you jump into visualization and reciting affirmations, it's crucial to get crystal clear on exactly what you want to call into your life. It's easy to fall into the trap of vague desires like I want to be rich or I want to win the lottery, but the universe responds best to specificity. Think of it like placing an order the more detailed you are, the greater the chance of getting exactly what you asked for. So ask yourself these key questions. What is the precise amount of money you desire to win? Don't be afraid to dream big, but make it feel achievable in your mind. Why do you desire this win? Is it about the financial freedom it represents, the ability to pursue your passions, help others, or experience a life of luxury? Connecting with the why infuses your intention with powerful emotional energy. How will you feel when you win? Focus on specific emotions, joy, relief, excitement, a sense of deep peace. Picture it in vivid detail. Once you've answered these questions, it's time to unleash the power of your imagination. Let's go beyond simply hoping for a lottery win and start making it feel real. Close your eyes and visualize the moment you discover your numbers match the winning draw. What do you see? Where are you? Are you alone or surrounded by loved ones when the realization hits? Observe the news report announcing the winner 
or scrutinize the lottery ticket in your hand. Imagine the surge of adrenaline, the wave of disbelief washing over you. Hear the sounds of celebration, whether it's cheers from your family or your own excited laughter. The greater the detail, the more you engage your senses, and the more potent an imprint of this reality you create within yourself. Remember, the universe thrives off of the specifics, beyond the numbers. While winning a specific amount is the core of this manifestation, don't stop there. Think about what those lottery winnings allow you to experience, to achieve, and to become. Picture the lifestyle that unlocks the places you travel, the home you might create, the projects you might pursue, and the ways you could make a difference in the world. Clarity of intention is like a beacon guiding every subsequent step you take on your manifestation journey. When you know exactly where you're headed, the universe can start aligning circumstances and opportunities in extraordinary ways. Step two, release resistance. Even with clear intentions and vivid visualizations, subtle internal resistance can hinder the manifestation process. Resistance manifests as limiting beliefs, doubts, and fears that often operate subconsciously. You might worry about external judgments, feel unworthy of significant wealth, or have underlying cynicism about luck stemming from past experiences. Identifying resistance. The first step in overcoming resistance is awareness. Observe your inner dialogue, especially when imagining yourself as the lottery winner. Do phrases like this is unrealistic, I don't deserve this, or money creates problems arise? Identify and document these resistant thoughts. Bringing them into conscious awareness lessens their hold on you. Further, explore the origins of these beliefs. Were they ingrained as a child? Do past experiences reinforce feelings of scarcity or a sense that good fortune is reserved for others? Understanding the root of these thought patterns is key to transforming them. Techniques for letting go. Here are effective methods for releasing resistance and fostering a mindset aligned with your manifestation goals. Affirmations craft positive statements that directly counter your resistant beliefs. To address issues of worthiness, you might repeat, I am deserving of abundance or I welcome unexpected good fortune into my life. Consistent repetition helps reprogram your subconscious mind. EFT emotional freedom technique commonly called tapping EFT blends acupressure and targeted affirmations to release emotional blockages. Search for beginner EFT resources specifically designed for overcoming doubts and fears. Challenging your beliefs examine the validity of your resistant thoughts. Are they objectively true or are there instances that contradict them? Explore alternative, empowering perspectives. Embracing open curiosity. Complete elimination of doubt may not be immediate. Rather than battling negativity, maintain a stance of open curiosity. View doubts as opportunities for deeper self-exploration and transformation of outdated beliefs. Ask yourself, what would need to change within me to fully believe that winning the lottery is possible? Remember, releasing resistance is an ongoing practice. Extend patience and self-compassion throughout the journey. As you dissolve internal blockages, you'll cultivate greater alignment between your thoughts, emotions, and deeply held beliefs. This synergy is where the potential for manifestation flourishes. Let me know if you'd like to refine this further or delve into additional steps of the manifestation process. Step three, act as if. One of the most powerful tools in your manifestation arsenal is to start embodying the energy of having already achieved your desire. Remember, the principle behind the law of attraction is that like attracts like. So if you want to attract the reality of winning the lottery, you must resonate with the frequency of a lottery winner. This isn't about pretending or faking emotions. It's about cultivating a genuine sense of having already received that which you desire. Ask yourself these questions. How would a lottery winner move through the world? Would they carry themselves with greater confidence and optimism? Would they be more open to taking calculated risks or pursuing dreams they might have put on hold? How would their perspective shift? Would they focus on possibility instead of lack? Would they feel a profound sense of gratitude, both for their winning and the abundance present in other aspects of their lives? How would their decisions change? 
Would they think long-term, be more generous with their resources, or start making choices aligned with a new, more expansive version of themselves? The power of gratitude. Gratitude is a potent catalyst for manifestation. When focusing on winning the lottery, extend your gratitude beyond just the vision of that future windfall. Practice gratitude for the good things already present in your life, your health, your loved ones, your unique talents and passions. This aligns you with a state of vibrational abundance, attracting more situations for which to be grateful. Cultivating gratitude is a practice. Start a gratitude journal, listing a few things you are grateful for each morning and evening. As you build this into your daily routine, you'll retrain your mind to focus on the positives present in your life, regardless of your current circumstances. Embodying abundance. Here's where acting as if becomes truly fun and empowering. Start making subtle changes to your behavior and mindset that reflect the life of a lottery winner. Treat yourself even small indulgences signal to your subconscious that you value yourself and expect good things. This could be a special coffee, a relaxing bath, or buying yourself a small gift. Decision making, ask yourself what would a lottery winner do? Would they research potential investments, look for their dream home, or start mapping out that bucket list trip? Embracing this decision-making process reinforces your internal belief system. Generosity being generous doesn't require winning the lottery. Even small acts of service, kindness, or sharing resources with others aligns you with a mentality of abundance rather than scarcity. Allow yourself to dream makes space for imagining your ideal life post-lottery win. Let yourself feel the joy and excitement without self-judgment. This keeps you connected to your desired outcome and strengthens the feeling of it already being yours. The importance of subtlety. It's crucial to find the sweet spot between embodying your desired reality and staying grounded in the present. If acting as if triggers feelings of frustration or a sense of inauthenticity, reassess your approach. Start with smaller shifts that feel organic and inspiring. The goal is to cultivate a quiet knowingness that your lottery win is on its way. It's about a subtle recalibration of your inner compass, guiding you towards thoughts, behaviors, and choices that bring you into greater alignment with your heartfelt desire. Step four, trust the process. Manifestation rarely happens overnight. The journey to attracting your lottery win or any other desired outcome requires a deep sense of trust in the process and in the vast, unseen forces at play. We live in an instant gratification society, so cultivating patience in the face of the unknown can be a powerful manifestation tool in itself. There's something incredibly transformative about surrendering to a larger plan, a grand scheme unfolding on its own timeline. The universe rarely operates according to our deadlines. Unexpected setbacks or periods of quiet may be an integral part of your manifestation journey. During these phases, it can be tempting to slip into feelings of doubt or discouragement. This is where trust becomes paramount. Think of a gardener tending a seed. The seed holds immense potential, but the gardener cannot force it to sprout on command. They do their part providing fertile soil, sunlight, water, and then trust in nature's process of growth. Your focused intention, visualizations, and actions are like the water nourishing the seed of your lottery manifestation. But just like the seed, it needs time and a supportive environment to flourish. So how do we nurture this unwavering trust, especially when our desired outcome has yet to materialize? Here are a few potent practices. Start consciously looking for small signs or coincidences hinting that you're on the right track. Maybe you see numbers related to your lottery win unexpectedly, or a chance conversation sparks inspiration for a new lottery strategy. Paying attention to these seemingly minor occurrences strengthens your belief in the invisible forces at work. Instead of viewing delays or obstacles as failures, see them as redirection. Perhaps there's a lesson to be learned, an aspect of yourself needing refinement, or a better path for your manifestation to unfold that you haven't yet considered. Tap into faith. This isn't necessarily about religious faith, but rather a deep-rooted knowing that there's a larger plan for your life. Trust that you're supported, that your determination, focus, and belief are all contributing to the grand design. Remember, manifestation is about co-creation, not dictation. 
Clinging too tightly to the how and the when of your lottery win can stifle the flow of energy. Release attachment to specific outcomes and timelines, opening yourself to the infinite possibilities that may not yet be visible to you. The balance of faith and action. Trusting the process doesn't mean passivity. Remain receptive to inspired action. Pay attention to your intuition, those inner nudges that might seem out of the ordinary. This could lead you to buy a ticket from a different location, try new number combinations, or even take seemingly unrelated actions that ultimately move you closer to your goal. This dance between faith and inspired action is delicate and potent. The universe often responds to our unwavering trust by guiding us towards the very opportunities or solutions we seek. The key is to remain open, observant, and ready to take steps in alignment with your desire. While some paths may remain shrouded in mystery, know that each step forward is part of the larger journey of manifesting your extraordinary lottery win. Trust that the when and the how will reveal themselves at precisely the right moment. So let's bring it all together. To manifest your lottery win, remember the core principles we've explored. Define your desire with crystal clear specificity. Don't just wish to win. Know exactly how much and why you want it. Cultivate an unshakable knowing that you can and will win. Replace limiting thoughts with empowering affirmations. See it, feel it, become it. Vividly visualize the moment of your lottery win and embody those emotions as if you're already living that reality. Trust, embrace patience and faith in the process. Remain open to inspired action and trust that the universe is orchestrating events in your favor, even if the path isn't always clear. Remember, manifestation isn't a magic bullet. It's a powerful tool that, with practice and dedication, can transform your mindset and open you to extraordinary possibilities. You have the ability to shape your reality, to call forth the abundance you desire. Don't underestimate the potential that lies within you. I encourage you to try this method for yourself. Be consistent, be open, and most importantly, believe in yourself. And we'd love to hear about your experiences. Share your stories, your questions, and your triumphs in the comments below. If you found the concepts discussed in this video helpful, be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to our channel world as life and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on future explorations of manifestation and mind expanding concepts. Until next time, keep dreaming big and expect the extraordinary.